All right, I'm gonna try to do puppy point of view feeding today. So, I'm gonna do this. Uh, all I do is pour out a line here. <laughs> And then come back, fill it in, old chow line, chow line, chow time. But this has uh, allowed me to let them all eat with, you know, a good space. We started out with 18 puppies. I'm down to 11. So, uh, if you're interested, I am dropping two boys down to 1,500 as a pet. Um, I will point them out specifically. It is the boy right here with the short tail. We call him Meatloaf. Knock it off! This one right here. He's 1500 as a pet. Loso, stop it, man. And so, yeah, we got our little boy, Buddy Meatloaf, is available for 1500. And the other one right now is this guy right here, and I call him TP, Tripolian Dynamite. Those two males, if that is a pet only, okay, that means they will have to be fixed. Um, but reality is, I have, well, seven pups still available, so I'm making a couple of them available to a very good pet, you know, as a very nice pet, to a good home. Um, I know that currently in our, uh, well, world, guys, everybody's having rough times. I understand that. You know, we're not doing uh, as well as we used to either, by any means. I'm not working and doing those things. So, but those two boys, um, if you're interested, it is first come, first serve. Uh, the entire amount would be due if you're wanting it right away. And you would have to schedule pickup or arrange delivery. Um, I will deliver the, the dog or the puppy. Um, we do have our baby girl due any day. So that is a uh, possible hindrance for me delivering. Um, but we'll get it to you, you know, pretty soon, one way or the other. Or you're welcome to come see me. Uh, I am in Alabama. And I have others available as well. Uh, but those are the only two currently at 1500 So everybody else goes up from there. Um, you know, essentially they're all available for the right ticket, I guess, would be so to speak. However, we have several keepers that we would prefer to keep here. Um, the white girl right here, she's staying. Uh, this girl right here is staying. The girl right there with, right here is staying and this male right here currently i'm holding three girls and a boy uh, i want to see how they do uh, if you're interested in a show male the top one right now would probably be that boy right there i call him boots he's super clean he's going to be thick once he fills out uh, he's going through a little bit lank lanky stage and he still looks phenomenal okay very clean boy this is fly uh, that is wish he's available as a pet or show breeder then you have meatloaf uh, this right here is thunder female she's available that is van that's van he's staying here that's solo she's staying here this is tp he is available for the 1500 that is Polar. She is available right here. Then you have Scoot. He's kind of shy. Um, actually, he's available in the 1500 category as well. So three males currently for 1500. And then this is Lightning. She's staying here. I hope you enjoy the crew. Uh, they're awesome pups for real. Like I'll try to show you guys a little more down on them. They're great structure, thickening out very well very consistent um the solid black and white ones are black ghost tries and the other ones are black tries 
the black tries are two and a half weeks younger than the other litter. And I got my little buddy meatloaf right here trying to get the camera while I'm here. But they're all awesome for real. There's not a bad pick among them. Um, currently for pets, you know, they're ranging from 1500 to uh, probably 2500 guys. I'm trying to be reasonable. I can't really go much lower, but I do need to get them moving. So not gonna, uh, it's not that I don't want to hold them. The reality is I cannot hold them. So if you're interested, we got this boy right here. He is available uh, for the lower price, 1500. This guy right here, so those two. And that boy right there, TP. This is Wes right here again. He's an awesome little dude. Um, he's going to be phenomenal. He is a potential show breeder. Uh, as you see, Lightning is Lightning is the biggest pup out of that litter right now. Uh, she wasn't when I picked her, but she has turned into a monster. She's a beautiful girl. Uh, her mama is Bustello, and she looks just like her mama. So she's stepping into her spot and mama is retired as well as available um, she's healing very well she had to have a knee surgery well she didn't have to but we chose to in hopes that it would help her long term and she seems to be doing very well um, we still keep her pretty contained because we're trying to let her heal it takes like uh, about four months for full recovery for the surgery that she had but she is uh, able to go to her, a new home if you're capable of taking care of her if not then you know she would stay here until someone comes along that is the right fit for her this is my crew hope you guys enjoy them as always they're getting big um, again there's minor differences between them the consistency was very strong on these litters so the flashy pups the ones that you know are real different like she's different everybody in the world's wanting to buy her uh it would take quite a bit for us to part with that girl right now. We want to watch her and see how she does. Um, you know, because like I said, I did these breedings for a reason. Specifically to find a couple of good girls. That's why I'm keeping three. Um, Thunder is a phenomenal girl. And which, here's Polar right here. That is a Loso female. Uh, she's phenomenal. She's huge. She looks just like her mama. She's super sweet. And then Thunder is right here, this dark girl. She's phenomenal as well. Either one is potential show breeder. Um, they are the last two females I have available currently. So they're currently listed at 3K, whether you take rights or not. Um, I recommend you did, because they're going to be pretty nice. So in the event you ever wanted to try... Uh, your hand at it you know we're here to help as much as we're able to I don't recommend you do it just to do it do not breed dogs just to breed dogs it takes a lot of work guys um, thank you know I was in a position because I had retired from my career so I'm home and that's why I did this God decided to play a little trick on me though and bless me with 18 puppies and I thank him every day but uh, he thought that one was funny and uh, he said, oh, okay, you want to breed dogs? Well, here you go. We're going to fill your plate up. And we have some other news, too, but that's not for this video. If you're still sticking around, thank you guys very much. We appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. And don't forget to share on social media or with a friend. Lightning says we would appreciate it. Thank you very much. And old Papaloso. Hey, Bo. Hello. And now it's pretty much nap time. Everybody will get up on the two beds, like everyone, and hang out for a while. We got beautiful weather here. We hope you do where you are. If not, we hope it improves. Hope you have a great day, everybody, and we will see you soon. All right, I'm going to try to do puppy point of view feeding today. So, I'm going to do this. Uh, all I do is 
pour out a line here. <laughs> And then come back, fill it in, old chow line, chow line, chow time. But this has uh, allowed me to let them all eat with, you know, a good space. We started out with 18 puppies. I'm down to 11. So, uh, if you're interested, I am dropping two boys down to 1500 as a pet. Um, I will point them out specifically. It is the boy right here with the short tail. We call him Meatloaf. Knock it off! This one right here. He's $1,500 as a pet. Loso, stop it, man. And 